Yo, what's going on? It's your ADHD immature counsellor, Yam Yam Patchy, and this is a classic chip shop video, Warsaw Edition, part two. If you want to see the other parts, they're linked in the description below. So as always, what I basically do in this series, if you're new to the channel, is I'll go around chip shops and just review them and give it a rating out of 10, basing it on the price, the portion size, and whether it's the iconic battered chips or not. Also, I'm dropping merch as well. It could be a couple of week wait time because I need to go and get it made, but I am going to be taking orders now. Go over to the official patch Instagram merch page and that's how I deal with it all. DM me on there. I don't make any money from making these videos so I would appreciate it if anyone could get it and support me. It would mean a lot. Or if you want to donate to the PayPal link, it will just go towards making these videos. With all that being said, let's get into the video. The first chip shop on the list is the Windsor Fish Bar located in Block Twitch. Can I get a small bag of chips please? Yeah. Do you do batter chips or? We do, yeah. Yeah, can I get a small batter chips please? That's it, thank you. We do chips. Why did you just say you do batter then? Yeah, I make videos and I review chip shops. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What's the channel in? Here we are at the Windsor Fish Bar. Once again, I'm in a bus stop, you know how we do it. £1.50, not batter chips. So that's already knocked points off. Portion size for a small bag, £1.50. I've seen better. I've seen I've seen I've seen better, but you know, it's okay for £1.50. I'm happy with this. They're just standard plain chips, really. I'd give it. I'd give it a seven. They're not bad for plain chips to be fair. Right, on to the next one. Next video, I'm getting one of them taking it to my real shopping centre. Yeah, yeah, safe, safe, safe. See, that's another chip shop show. Online says they're open. You're lucky today. You'll get it next time. The second chip shop on the list is the Shellfield Fish Bar. Cheers, mate. Thank you. Love you. That was the. That was a Sheffield. Smell buzz. That was the Sheffield Chippy. £1.70. Battered chips. Portion size. Looks decent. Oh, there's a hair in it. I don't know if you can see it, but there's a hair on the chip. See, I don't know what to give them now because I've never had a hair before on the chips. I've still got to try them. <laughs> Do you know what? They're actually really nice. See, that's hard. Because of the hair, I'd give them an eight. I would give them an eight because these aren't bad. Portion size decent, battered chips. Chips are nice. Because of the hair, I guess I've just got to not give them a rating at all. If there was no hair, I'd give these a strong an eight. But because those are hair, then they're going to get a zero because you, that's just not acceptable, is it? Do you know what I mean? Like, come on. That was that Sheffield chippy. On to the next one. The third chip shop on the list is the Village Chippy, located in Rushall. So that was the Village Chippy, £1.80. These chips look fire. These are the iconic battered chippy chips. They're fresh. They smell good. £1.80 is a good price. They're crunchy, which I love. Mm. These are the one. These are the one. Yo, they're really good. I'm giving it a nine. These are the best chips I've had in Warsaw so far. I reckon it'll be hard to beat these. Iconic battered chippy chips. Mouth-watering chips, yo. I think it lives up to it, you know. I think it actually lives up to that. That side is true. That's, a, that's, a, that's not a bad chip thing. You're right, mate. Basically, I make videos on YouTube where I review chip shops. And I've done all the Black Country ones, and I'm in Warsaw now doing a Warsaw series. And this is the best chip shop I've found in Warsaw so far. Them chips, I'll give it a 9, a rate out of 10. You've got the best chips in Warsaw so far, mate. Thank you. No worries, mate. They're really nice. It's all right, mate. Don't worry about it. The fourth chip shop on the list is the King Cod Chippy located in Blakemore. Oh, everyone's going to be walking past looking at me, thinking, why is this geezer filming himself? Right, that, yeah, was King Cod chip shop. Battered chips, yeah. Two pounds, portion size. Portion size is all right, yeah, for two quid. But I mean, you're right. Here we go. Mmm. Then again, I don't know if it's because I'm hungry. Because I'm hungry, it's making me believe, yeah, these are nice, but they're all right, to be fair. Two quid. Nah. Oh, nah. Probably give it a seven. If that's your local chip, I'd be happy with that. That was King Pod. On to the next one. The fifth chip shop on the list is the Victoria Fish Bar, also located in Blighton, or literally a minute down the road from the last one. Yes, please. Are you taking the photography? Nah, nah, nah. I make videos and I review chip shops. Ah. Yeah, yeah. So I'm gonna what rate you your chips. Us? I'm gonna rate your chips out of ten. Yeah. Thank you. One seventy, yeah. Leave the money. Give us good reviews. Nah, nah. I've got to pay. I can't do that. Make it be fine. 
So, shall we write it down for you? Sure, sure. I'm literally outside somebody's house doing this. <laughs> it's got to be done. So that was the Victoria chip here. Yeah? Nice people, but I can't let that sway me. They charged me a pound instead of 170. Can't let that sway me either. So I know you're going to be watching this because I wrote it down for you. I, look, I can't, I can't give people like special treatment. Do you know what I mean? Just because they sort, they sort me out. You know what I mean? I can't, I can't do it. I've got to be fair. But you are nice people. So portion size for one pound seventy. Could, could, could be slightly better. Could be. So, oh, oh look, I can't be biased. I got. I got to say this. They do look nice. He says they're cooked in like beef as well, like beef dripping. Mm. They are fresh as well and crunchy, which I like. I do like crunchy chips. They are good. Yeah. But the chip shop up the road, the one I went to before, it's literally only a minute up the road. Personally, I'd rather go to that one. Uh, look, I know. I know. I'm being. I'm being harsh. I'm being harsh. But it's. It is what it is, innit? I gotta be honest. But they're not bad. Out of 10. I can't, I've gotta be true. I'll probably give it a 6.5, if I'm honest. But the staff are very, very friendly. And they're fresh as well. I'm gonna give it a 6.5. But they're all right, like, they're all right. That was the uh, Victoria Chippy. On to the next one. The sixth chip shop on the list is the Pinfold Chippy, located in Blocks. Well, let's get small chips, please. Small chips, no problem. Thank you. Cheers, mate. Have a look at you. Probably shouldn't be out here. Ugh. You all right? Okay. Yeah, I'm okay. I'll be going in a second. I'm just going to review these chips. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's so funny. She comes out. She comes out the back of the Chinese. Like, what are you doing here? Roof. Don't matter what I'm doing. Watch what you're doing. I work for the council. That's all you need to know. Some little kid poked his head out his window yeah, of the car and was like, Are you on your sister's bike? I should have said, no, I'm on your fucking mum's on what? Right, that was two pound, that pinfold chippy, block switch, yeah. Portion size is kind of mad, you know. This, this looks like a large bag of chips, I can't lie to you. That is a small bag of chips. Bro, that looks like a large. They are plain chips, but I will give them a review, and so far they're off to a good start. As far as plain chips go, I'll give them a 6.5, only because portion size is amazing. For two pounds, all that. The chips are okay, they're not the best, and they're not the best plain chips either. And for two pounds, you get all of that. I mean, that will feed like three of you. I'll give it a 6.5. That being said, on to the next one. Dan, you know, it's rude to talk with your mouth full. Nah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The sixth chip shop on the list is the Field Road Fish Bar, also located in Bloxwich. <laughs> Oh, we won't get that. Yeah. We live in Ensford, so. Oh, okay. And we come over here for a few days. Yes, please, mate. Thank you. Oh, yeah. I'm balancing you on some skip right now. This person comes out of this house now. I'm literally sitting on the middle of a pavement. Like, God help me. You are right? <laughs> that was Field Road Chippy. That woman who was in there, I don't know if you could hear her talking, she travels from afar here. And she says they're the best chips she's had. You won't get no better. Do you know who I am? Do you, do you know who I am? I will be the judge if these are good chips or not. £2.80 for a small chip. A bit extortionate. That is extortionate. They are battered. The portion size is wham. Yeah, can't lie. It's, it's all falling. They're all falling everywhere. But you get the, you get the idea. Let's give it a taste. I won't find no better. <laughs> you chat shit, <laughs> that woman. They're not even that good. They're not that good. I mean, they're better than the last place. They don't beat the village chip, you know. Two pound eighty for a small chips. I give it a six. This video has shown me one thing: chip shops in the black country are better than the ones in Warsaw. I put it out there already, and I've still got so many more chip shops to review. Like this ain't even the, the last Warsaw chip shop video. <laughs> On to the next one. <laughs> Thank you for letting me film outside your house. Not that you had a choice anyway. <laughs> the seventh chip shop on the list is a Spring Lane Chippy, which was shut yesterday, but I'm here today. Yes, Rob, can I just get a regular chip, please? Now, I'll review chip shops. Oh, you review yeah, chip yeah, shops? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I went there yesterday and it was shut, so I'm here today. Yep, I'm on somebody's stairs in an alley. Yep, could get robbed, could get <coughs> Edit that out. Not child friendly. There's nothing child friendly about <coughs> Honestly, how far I push some of the things I say in these videos is questionable. Okay, £2.20. Portion size is decent. There's a few plain chips in here. That's not very good. They're just standard battered chips, really. Yeah, just standard battered chips. Nothing really jumps out at me to say these are fire. They're a bit cardboardy. I'll give them a six. I'm just picking out plain chips. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't want to see that in my battered chips, otherwise I'd ask for mixed chips. 
I know I might be harsh and you might be thinking, he's a dickhead. I'm not. I'm just being honest. Like, I'm just a general guy giving a review on chip shops. That's all I am. I'm just, I'm just one of you. I'm just a normal person. Then again, my dad says there's nothing normal about you, son, which is true, but I'm just a normal geezer. Do you know what I mean? I'm just a geezer. Yeah. Geezers. <laughs> How am I not a virgin? I don't know. I don't know what women see. I can't even speak. I don't know what women see in me. Honestly. Obviously. Eh? <laughs> that weren't me. <laughs> I'm ending this video here. That was the last chip shop. I can't be asked. All I've ate is nothing but chip shop for the past two days. If you enjoyed the video, do all of that YouTuber shit, yeah? I will next upload on the date that's on the screen now. So put it in your calendars, yeah? Get that reminder. 8 p.m. I'll be uploading. Any chip shops that you want me to review next, put them in the comments below. And you might see it in the next future videos. Don't forget to put your wheelie bin out. And with all that being said... <coughs> See you in a bit. <laughs>